Hello, everybody. He is Michael Mock. So welcome to Mike Work Channel. Okay, let's talk about two poor women live in Cambodia. She is Cambodian. So, for what and to talk her about her life. So, there's the provident is Kampong Spu in Cambodia. So they also poor, and then her parents poor too, and they passed away. They left two daughters behind, but they in the poor life. They have no place to stay. You can see her house here. It's somebody a land to allow her to live in that land. That land is not for her but they own this land they are so kind they let her stay you know the place to stay and she go to pick up some recycle or some material they throw away to build there to be a home she get her home sweet home but two of them her name is Kong and the other Kun and they two a sister they make a living by going pick up recycle can or anything available like cardboard, like aluminum can or plastic bottle and to make their living to survive. It's not for something like a really job, really it's the local business something, but they just getting something to survive. How much did they earn? They earn less than two dollars a day. If lucky, they got two dollars and fifty cents. But four thousand real, it changed to be American dollar, just one dollar. And then they earn seven thousand real to eight thousand real. At some time, they earn ten thousand real. You know, like eight thousand real, seven thousand real. It's 7,000 real in American dollar. It's $1.75. 8,000 real is $2. And 10,000 real is $2 and a half, $2.50. It's not enough for their living. It's very low, their income below, you know, be, below. And then they didn't have clean water to use. They have no medical care, or they don't have any 401k benefit, retirement plan, or anything. They don't have the welfare. They don't have Medicaid. They don't have Medicare. They didn't have anything, nothing. And her sister got some, you know, like disease or cancers on her friend. They didn't have any fresh, both of them, just they cut it up. And she still owed the hospital too by this treatment, but they didn't have any money. That two sisters live by picking recycles around. There's nothing around there. It's just taking a chance, something to do, something for survival. But this time we heard, but we talked for what and me, like I told every video, we work as a team. We we didn't have any community or any church, anybody to help, but we start from zero. So I said, I live in the United States, so we do YouTube. I said, hey, why don't you go out there and ask people and help people, maybe a few dollars I have, I give you hundred dollars to go helping them. but. The first they start, they not uh, believe in themselves, what they're doing for this job, it's hard, but later on I keep asking them, but they go. <laughs> and when they go there, they give some a few dollars, but later on they found more poor and they start to do it. Why don't we team up to do this job? But And then they live in Cambodia. I live in the United States. We be a team, three people, and then 
I try to make videos and let people know what I'm doing here and we got some donation and donate by people who live in the United States so I send those donation to helping them and we got the first one that donate by Khun Thao and her husband and her husband name Wan Khan about fifty dollars so he spent for ten dollars for gas and then we give her forty dollars to start new business so Utak and to work telling them first step like why don't you change uh, whatever you do every day pick up recycle and sell for your living to sell the grocery or something and come your home and they both could not make any decision because you know people live in the dark it's hard to make their decision no exit no idea no mindset no concept no anything no everything because they're so poor they live in the poor they live in a poverty life generation to generation for a long long time that's why they get no exit give them some idea you know like something you throw in the dirty place, like the mud or some place dirty, just let it sit there, rain and temperature to destroy though. But if you want to restore it, you have to cut it out some part bad and some part good, you take it and clean it and sand it out and spray it, make a new skin. That's the way to work and to talk to, just refresh and give them hope, no more despair in the future. Go give them hope in the future and then they start to believe their two guys and then she said yes okay yeah all right all right we got it start for start okay she said yes so we got some money donated by people live in the united states they had the kindly heart they they feeling how you know the poor is no exit live in the dark so Okay, let's put this way and to what to that help. And then just forty dollars you can start your business. What should I do? And you know, just go to the local store and then uh, buy something and sell in front of your home. So later on that the first time and after that to what and to tap land. Second time, they went back. Okay, they saw her buy some little shit, little this, and uh, you know, water, some put in the coolers, and then they saw, yeah, I make about thirty thousand real today, or two, you know, like uh, twenty thousand real today, and uh, to talk to what so happy, I'm happy too, you know, because I start it, I'm happy. Too. Okay, it, we got it. Uh, to help to reduce all the poor of the poverty life to change their life it's great it's great and she needs some bicycle so we bought the food supply like right like everything from so fish oil and everything like the canned fish everything and to give to her and you can see this bicycle she didn't know how to ride the bicycle yet yeah she tried the best to learn it and we get the food and we get the bicycle and then we give some money donate from the other general people and that's it <laughs> that's it after that the word and to talk so happy they talk so much in there that story i'm so excited for uh, what is robert uh, his name and putak is the peer his name but they like to put their nickname like pu it means uncle Putak is Uncle Tak, Puwood is Uncle Wood. They're so happy. I say, they're speaking crazy. <laughs> Maybe at the now with are speaking <laughs> because they're so excited that first step to helping poverty people to breaking through the poverty to get a better life. They're so excited. Even myself too, I'm so happy. 
they just call me to be FaceTime. I'm, I'm go crazy to do this. <laughs> it, you know, you know how they feel. It's so happy to help somebody who breaking through. So she keeps some food, bicycle, and then she can ride, and then some money too to give to her. So but and the tag came back. This is the short time. They come to visit her, so, so everything just amazing. They grow big. <laughs> Say, oh, yeah, good. And they give more money to her, to supporting her, like a hundred dollar more. To support you can go buy something more and sell more and make your life better so especially the fan the billet from Suka palm leaf you can see that that look beautiful all natural handmade she can make like 20 or 30 fans today and they can sell like 10 fans they can earn 30,000 real so, oh that great she create more business, so, and then she came, why don't you try this, this fan and for what try? Okay, well, it look good, it feeling good, you know, it make it from original sugar palm <laughs> leaf, sugar palm leaf, and then they ask, let's send to Pooh Michael son. She call me Pooh, it's uncle, send to Pooh Michael son, and then you got my sister-in-law going to Cambodia at next month on February, so uh, we can get that, and I will show to you. They give about uh, five to me. I'm so happy. They give some to put with their food tag too. They're just happy, and we keep connected with, you know, the FaceTime to see what's going on, how to change this thing, and so we're happy to helping them to get out of the, the trap of poverty. That's what we do. <laughs> yeah, you guys can support it too. Please, when you see this video, hopefully share, okay? And follow the story by story. We're helping family by family to start it. And we help like the homeless children. We're helping people who get sick and not afford to go see doctors or to go to hospital. And we help old people and we help people who broke and not standing up to start their life with the low vision, you know, to getting better life we help. But where we get this budget from? So it from this video that you guys watch. <laughs> and if you guys like it, please leave the comment below and we start from there. We connect you to the family, the people who you want to help. We connect you to directly to forward and protect it real, right? <laughs> And then what I do, I try to connect you guys from here to there and who you want to help, who you want to sponsor. You know, some kind of agent, but I like to help. I spend my own money. It's first time I just spend my own money, but I will try a little bit. It worked. So it worked. Why not? Just keep going. And you know, learning from whatever we do. That's all that what we do. We have no business no community, no anything. It start from zero, it's just from our heart. It, it no business, no answer, you know. But I started this book and give him money to give to the poor people. So it worked, we started. It's so happy it's about, you know. <laughs> nothing else we do, I get older, and then nothing I leave behind after I die. I just do something good deed to give to people, good heart to give to people good heart to give to people. People will be happy. <laughs> all right, guys, that's all it's about. It's about her story. She lived at Cambodia and in Kampong Spu Providence. And her name is Kong. And the other name is Ku. She happy and be happy. We'll go to team and share the video to the world. If you guys see, please help to share this video if you have a heart. <laughs> Not saying too loud, but only share like something good to do it, you know, in life. And if you like to support my channel, like Mike's work, Mike 
works, please subscribe and click notification bell to get new video upload every day. I try my best every day at 6 p.m. at Central Time. All right, guys. I think that's all about it. Thank you for your watching and thank you very much for viewers like you. It helped me a lot. It helped the world, okay? Bring peace to the world and have more compassion to think about, to do about, to help about poor people, breaking through the poverty life and saving them from the dark and to the life. Sunlight, the beautiful beach, right? That good thing to do, all right? If you guys agree, please click the support, subscribe and click notification bell. And to get new videos, you guys watch, don't need to do nothing. Or you don't like, just don't comment, <laughs> okay? Just, it's up to you, you know? Uh, it's free to go, it's nothing to hurting you. But I just bring it from Cambodia, we just, I got a bad memory nightmare from there. That's why I be here. I in the wonderful land, in the wonderland, the land of opportunity. So I'm free, live in the, the beautiful home, beautiful car, beautiful food, and beautiful clothes, everything is more than enough. I went to the beach, see the blue sky, enjoy my life every time, every weekend I want. But they don't have any chance. Please help if you want to. If you don't want, just come to watch. It means if you watch this video from the beginning to the end, it means 100% you're helping them. Because no money, you can see the view. I didn't make much money on this YouTube, just a little view, less than 100 view or 200. And you know, it's not much. If you help more, see, I get those money from YouTube and then I send to Cambodia and then to helping them. You see, when you watch this video and share, you help already, right? If you don't want to come in, it's fine. You don't want to like, fine. Just help to be Judy. That's why I say thank you very much for viewers like you and your support. Please subscribe and then click notification bell to get new video upload at my channel, Mike Works, every 6 p.m. at Central Time. All right, guys, that's all about. Thanks for your watching, and thank you very much for you will like you. Stay tuned for the next video. Bye-bye now. See you next time. Bye. Thank you.